So, a channel member called Time Sensitive has said that this ESC can run on 4S. I'm not so convinced. <laughs> what do you think? Do you think it's worth trying? This is the Surpass Hobby 80 Amp um, ESC and this is two newly charged up uh, 2S 2200 milliamp hour batteries. Before I do anything, I will show you that they are fully charged. Please keep an eye over here while I do this. Of course, it focuses on my hand, so I will come over here. Dun, dun, dun. Eight point three nine and eight point four three. Okay, if you saw my last video, you know that I made up one of those little dingle dongles, which is to turn it into a series. So I need to firstly uh, 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 plug in that. Uh, maybe do it the right way around, and then plug it into the second of that way around. And now we are ready to go. I'm going to leave it not in the car in case everything goes completely to crap. And then plug it in here. Excellent. I assume that we're in focus. The remote is turned on. Fire extinguishers are ready. You ready ladies and gents? Place your bets now. Will it go big bang or would it all be okay? Woo. Let's go. Why no big bang? I did all of this for nothing. Seriously? Uh, make sure that that's out of the way. Ah. We have no throttle. Oh man. That is just no good. We have no big bang. But we have no acceleration either. That's just plugging one of the batteries in. So, 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 so. ESC not blown. It's good. Plug this one in and this one in and sixteen point eight two. So all is good, but we still have no brum brum. So, is it the ESC that is just stopping it happening? Let me unplug that. Let me take these off. And we have a programming card here. Uh, da, da, da. I'll just plug in one of them while I'm using the programming card. Just gonna go down. Oh no. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. 
Excellent. Right, let's just see if that makes any difference. I don't think it will. But I will try something afterwards as well, I just thought of, so. Um, I need them both to be plugged in again. No. Okay, right. I actually have no idea. Okay, I'm gonna be back soon once I've problem solved. See you soon. Okay, I can't find a solution, and I'm a bit gutted actually, because I wanted to see the 124017 uh, on 4S. So what I've got is, this is the JLB Cheetah, and apparently it can run the 4S. So I'm just gonna quickly plug this in. Um, I was just gonna do it off camera, but then I'm like, but what if it blows up? You know, we all want to see, don't we? Um, I am just going to actually do the 2S first, just to make sure it's not turned on. I don't even know where the power button is. There we go. Okay, so. Plug that back in. Plug this in. Wait for the big bang bing. No. Turn it on. Is it touching anywhere? Yes, I'm gonna lift it up instead. Jesus! Okay. Once I've done this video, I'll obviously be doing the, the video with the JOE Cheetah on 4S. My god, that is bonkers. Okay, let's put this ESC in the 124017 and see how we get on. Okay, I'm just gonna say right off the bat that it was a very windy day and none of my new microphones have arrived yet. So I apologize, please put up with it and it will get better next week.
I thought I would try with these tires, these are the Eshin E18 1.4 tires. What was clear on this surface is that it's impossible for me to hit full throttle. All of these runs I was around between 50 and 70% full throttle. Every time I tried to do 100, it just went into a spin. So we're going to have to save it for up into Arley. Okay, it was at this point that I had to uh, call it a day. Um, this is just a little snippet from my next video. I put on some crazy large tires and it was just crazy to drive. Um, the ESC did not overheat, nor did the motor. I was very impressed with it. The problem is that I couldn't get above sort of 50, 55% throttle without it, it wanting to kill itself. So the only option for me, this is easily going over 100 uh, kilometers an hour. So I'm going to have to wait until I get up to Ta'ali uh, with that large area. And then oh, I don't even know what to do for tires. Every time I put tires on this thing, it just tears them apart. Anyway, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I will catch you next time. Stay safe. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.